Hello and welcome. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to use Google Originality Reports. This video assumes that you already know how to set up an assignment in Canvas. So once you've created the assignment, we're going to scroll down and change the submission type to an external tool. Now we're going to click Find, and we're going to scroll down until we find the Google LTI, or Google Assignments LTI 1.3, right there. Now we're going to go ahead and continue. We're going to come here and click this little toggle that says to check for plagiarism or originality. So I'm going to turn that on. It gives me this warning because we only are able to do this five times per course in Canvas. And so it really wants to make sure that I'm getting the most bang for my buck out of it. I'm not. This is a waste, but hopefully it helps everybody else learn how to do this. So then we go ahead and just click continue. And now we can attach a file to this. So, um, you know, I can attach some paper or some template that maybe would help the students with their research project. And then eventually I'm going to run the originality report on it. So let's scroll down. I think we called it check for plagiarism. Plagiarism, there it is. Okay. And each student's going to get a copy. You know, we can adjust the points, the due date, all that, whatever, um, for this demo not necessary. So now I'm just going to say create. It's going to save those details. I just lost one of my plagiarism checkers, but that's okay. I'm going to click select. I scroll down. You know, you can adjust all those things as you need. And now I'm going to click save and publish. Okay. So what we'll do now is wait for a student to turn in an assignment, and I'll show you how to run the plagiarism check. All right. So I had a student submit the assignment. So now we can check and see whether there's, um, we can run their originality report. So let's go ahead and click on the assignment title and that will open up a new tab. And we see that student 04 here has submitted the assignment. And what we see right away is that it already is telling us that the originality report that was run has found two flagged passages. And that's a good thing actually for this demo um, because I what I did for the assignment was just straight up copied and pasted a Wikipedia article into the Google Doc that I shared with the students. Now, one thing to note that I didn't mention previously is that students can run the originality report themselves. And so before they even turn it in, and they're very much prompted to do this, uh, it will really make sure that they've run the originality report. So they know what they're doing um, if that comes up. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And then we can see this is just completely a um, copied Wikipedia article. But over here, it's going to tell me what the flagged passages are. So I can click where it says flagged passages. And <laughs> as we see, almost all of it is flagged. All of it should be because I didn't make up any of it. And what's really neat about this too is it will tell you the source. So um, not only will it tell you if it's not original, if it's copied or plagiarized, uh, it also tells you where the students found the source of that material. So that's how we can use the Google originality report feature with in Canvas and the um, Google LTI, Google Assignments LTI. So thank you so much for watching and goodbye.